Hi, may I introduce you to Josh and Paul, both are project managers in a big company and at the moment they're planning their projects. As we can see, both need Jackie in their project. We know this won't end well. Should we say something? Now let's see what happens. Jackie looks really confused and switches to the other team. Josh has noticed it, but he doesn't know why Jackie has joined the other team. Good for him that he can use Jira and the AIM resource management app to see clearly what's going on in his project. As we can see now, Jackie is really overscheduled. Great, that's so easy to adjust. And now Jackie is correctly scheduled in the Alpha project. Oh no, now Paul noticed that Jackie is no longer scheduled in his project. He needs to collaborate with Josh and share Jackie. So Paul can afterwards adjust his plan and everyone has a successful project running again. Jackie seems to be happy again. Nevertheless, what's going to be in the future? The next few weeks looking great here. But in the long run, some team members can't work their full capacity. Ah, Josh is thinking the same. He worries that they will have less work to do. Now Josh knows that he needs new projects and is able to plan these for the future. A few weeks later, some new conflicts appeared. Paul's project doesn't look great in the long run. Many team members are overscheduled. He needs support for his project. With adding a placeholder for a new team member, he can adjust his project and see what qualification the new member should bring along. In this case, Paul needs a developer for his team. Now he can call Claudia from Human Resources and ask her to hire a developer for his project. Seems like everything's going to work out for Paul. But let's see how it goes. Wow, Claudia did a great job. Paul and the new developer Mark get along very well. Now Paul can easily rename the placeholder to Mark's name. And if you want to see your teams and customers look this happy, plan ahead. Start now to manage your teams with AIM Resource Management for Jira.